This weekend in Des Moines, Drake University will be hosting the 2023 Federal Duck Stamp Contest. So the winner of that contest will have a piece of their art turned into a stamp, benefiting conservation efforts. Local 5's Larissa Millis is live this morning at Drake to tell us more about this contest. Larissa, very interesting here. What are you learning? Yeah, good morning, guys. As you mentioned, I am here on Drake University's campus, which will be the host to that competition today and tomorrow. Now, the federal duck stamp competition was conceived in 1934 after President Franklin D. Roosevelt signed the Migratory Bird Hunting and Conservation Act into law, which uh, protects wetland conservation. Now, according to the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service, 98 cents from every stamp purchased goes back to benefit uh, wetland habitat conservation. So every year the competition is held and a winner is chosen. And we're here this morning with one of the competitors in this year's competition, Kira Sabin. Good morning, Kira. Good morning. <laughs> Thank you for having me. So you this you just mentioned to me that this is your fifth year competing. Mm -hmm. Tell me a little bit about how you got into something like this. Uh, my grandpa, Grandpa Dave, told me about it in 2019. Uh, he used to hunt, uh, and I've always loved art, and since then I've been pretty obsessed. <laughs> and kind of walk us through what the competition is like, kind of the different rounds you mentioned. Oh, yeah. Uh, there's five uh, judges on the panel. It's over two days, and there's three rounds. First day is uh, first round, and then second day you learn who wins. And this has quite a following online. You actually happen to have your own TikTok account, which has nearly 300,000 followers, and you post a lot about um, your artwork in the competition. What is it kind of like to see people be so invested in something like this? That was definitely unexpected. I knew that I love the duck stamp, but I didn't know that many other people would as well. Uh, it's been overwhelmingly positive, and I couldn't be more grateful. What kind of content do you share on your TikTok mostly as it relates to this um, competition? I start when I start taking photographs and then I go all the way through my painting process, all the way through this judging process, uh, just to involve everyone else. And what are you hoping happens at the competition this year? Do you feel like you might get a win or kind of what's kind of your hope here? I think I definitely won't win. I just always want to improve from last year. I would love to make it to the final and third round of judging this year. That'd be amazing. Very, very cool. Well, we're going to continue talking to Kira throughout the morning here, but I'll send it back to you guys for now. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, you learn something new every day. You can see some of this year's entries on your screen. Be sure to check back on weareiowa.com later today for more information on the Federal Duck Stamp Contest and a link to the competition's live stream. All right.